it was an unplanned encounter on New Year's Eve in Robe in 2015. That was the spark that ignited Emily and Duncan's life together. I used to think that long distance was for people that didn't really like each other. <laughs> that might be true for some, but I think for the rest of us, long distance is for the determined and stubborn couples that just bloody love each other. Anyone that knows Dunk knows that he's a jokester, he's full of laughs, he's full of jokes, but he's also so full of love. It's honestly behind everything he does. It must be love when you gave up your career as an aircraft engineer to follow him to Panola and become a potato farmer. <laughs> You're the most amazing, kind-hearted daughter and sister we could ever ask for. We're so proud of all your achievements. Moving away to Adelaide to study and then work as a physiotherapist, make your wonderful new friends along the way. Sometimes when the fight burns through the night, leave you We're here today to share the marriage of two special friends in this glorious part of the world here in Panola. A relationship that began four years ago at a New Year's Eve meeting in Robe to the soundtrack of Jonas Blue's version of Tracy Chapman's Fast Car now sees a strong foundation of love where loyalty, trust, respect, integrity and appreciation is valued and shared. It is this most trusting and inseparable relationship that we will celebrate here today. Duncan, the first night we met, it was weird that it wasn't weird. We clicked like an old married couple and here we are today. You make me laugh and feel safe and loved. I love your thoughtfulness, kindness and ability to ground me. Your sing-alongs in the shower, your voices for each animal, and your uncanny sense of humour. You push me to my limits, encourage me, and you are my biggest supporter. I promise to support you, to honour you, and to love you unconditionally, even when you force me on a roller coaster or a helicopter ride when the trees are almost sideways. I can't imagine where I would be without you, and I can't wait to continue this crazy journey with you. Let's hope one day our children have those jealous nights. I love you, love you. The first night I met you, felt like I hadn't met you before. Like I had known you for most of my life already, we were just finally coming together at the right time. You came into my life at the darkest point, and you shone your light into it. You were the girl in the white dress, you stole my platter food, and then you stole my heart. <laughs> you were the next stage of my life I had no idea was coming. You are the highlight of my days when I come home to you. You are always there for me. And I am always grateful for everything you do for me and the home that you create for us. I promise to always be there for you and take care of you. Even when you've jammed a zipper on your skin tight jacket, puffer jacket at 3am and we've had a few too many cordials and I just want to go to sleep, but I will be there for you. You are the juice that's worth the squeeze and I will forever love you and be your best friend. Today has been the best day to be able to marry my best friend and my partner in crime. From the first day I met you, it really felt like we've known each other a long time. We were an old couple already and we've just celebrated today and with our favourite people and got a piece of paper for us. On the clouds, your heaven sent. Did it hurt when you hit the ground? You sparkle like a diamond. One thing that I do hope has improved under Emily's strict adult supervision is Dunk's culinary skills. <laughs> Emily, you've taught me how to cook and I've taught you how to gamble.
Since M has been in Dunk's life, she has only made Duncan a better man, and I now can't imagine them not being together. I cannot wait to see and hear about the non-fur baby family that you both create. <laughs> And I have absolutely no doubt that the two of you only have a future of happiness, success and love ahead. Emily, you're a Jamison now. Not really much going for us. So welcome to the family. I love you and I will always be by your side through thick and thin. I still to this day don't know the secret to how we work or why we work, but we just do and I love that about us. I love that it is just so easy with us. I can't wait to see what life throws at us and to take it head on. You keep doing you and I'll keep doing me and I reckon we'll be fun. Family and friends, please share in Emily and Duncan's joy as I undertake the authority invested in me to declare them to be husband and wife. If you may know it's by doing it the most appropriate way. It's magic for real, I'm freaking love.